Former President Donald Trump spoke at the Prairie du Chien Art Center today. News 8 Now's Allison Fergit was there and has the details. Michael, Trump focused his speech today on legal immigration and the southern border. His visit comes after an undocumented immigrant was arrested in Prairie du Chien after assaulting a woman and her child. During his speech, Trump worked to tie Vice President Harris to illegal immigration. Republicans have named Harris the border czar. It's a reference to Biden previously tasking Harris to work with officials from Latin American countries to address migration to the U.S. Four years ago, I handed Kamala Harris the most secure border in U.S. history, the lowest illegal immigration on record. Kamala Harris's actions completely opened up the border and made it very unsafe. Legal immigration was not at its lowest point in history when Trump left office. Migration at the southern border did hit a three-year low in April 2020 while Trump was president, but it increased during the remaining eight months of his term. During a speech, Trump also slammed Harris's Friday visit to the southern border. But what Kamala did not talk about in her remarks last night were the countless Americans who've been brutally assaulted and killed by illegal aliens. And Trump spoke about the recent arrest of an undocumented immigrant in Prairie du Chien. The man faces charges including sexual assault, strangulation, and battery. This animal crossed Kamala's wide open border along with hundreds of thousands of others that are worse than him, that are worse than him. Trump's speech comes days after the head of Immigration and Customs Enforcement reportedly said the agency released 435,000 undocumented migrants with criminal convictions. What Kamala Harris has done to our border is a betrayal of every citizen. It's a betrayal of her oath, and it's a betrayal of the American nation. Trump hammered home the same message throughout the speech, that he's the only candidate that can secure the southern border. But it all stops the moment I raise my hand and take the oath of office as your 47th President of the United States. It all stops. Although today's focus was primarily on illegal immigration, Trump also briefly touched on inflation and criticized Biden and Harris's green energy policies. Reporting in Prairie du Chien, Allison Fergit, News 8 Now. Allison, thank you.